this summer I'm in charge of actually taking uh, taking and being in charge of the geometry advanced class which is gonna be a it's a proposal that we did it, the proposition was really simple really easy we recruit kids that got exceeded expectations from the algebra one class and that got recommended by the teachers and at the same time we get the best one from the EOC the geometry class, we, what, we, what we do, we divide it into two sections. The first one is going to be the ones that are coming from middle school that they didn't have the opportunity of, uh, of getting one class of the geometry, I mean the algebra one slash geometry from middle school, and the ones that we already have in the high school that they didn't realize that they're really good in math. Entonces, what we planned eight years ago, actually, when early college started and when the regular, the regular population started, we got together all the math teachers and we tried to propose or we tried to actually come with something to fulfill the requirements not only of the society but actually the future generations that we need STEM kids. This is what I tell them. What do you have to actually contribute to every day, every single day? Entonces, this is what uh, th I make them responsible. I make them the, to be the designers of the future. And I tell them, you're going to do your own city. You're going to be the owner. You're going to be the architect. You're going to be the civil engineer. You're going to be everything. So what we did, because most of the kids are going to say, why? Where am I going to use it in life? These concepts, where am I going to use it in life? And those, I teach them concepts, and the concepts are not only to be there and to be like man, must memorize. No, they have to apply it. So the grading is tough. The grading is really tough, but it's worth it. It's worth the time. And the kids feel like ownership, and that's what I want for them to actually feel.